Today was an incredible result as Bayern took all three points at the Red Bull Arena Leipzig. Let's get right into it. So today, Bayern Munich had a 4-1 victory at RB Leipzig today. It was a very, very strong and assertive victory. We scored, outscored them 4-1 and an expected goals of 4.1 to 0.9. So, you know, it's crazy how closely the scoreline was to expected goals. So surprisingly for Leipzig, they had 53 possession, but they were obviously heavily outscored and were heavily XG'd. Um, so it just does show that possession isn't, possession isn't everything these days. Um, the game is, you know, changing compared to what people used to think. You know, possession was the be-all, end-all 10 years ago, but, you know, people are looking at it differently now. But looking at Leipzig now, they have three out of four losses on the season so far. So every single game has been a loss, except for one really not the start they're going to want. And they're really struggling, as I said. Going into this game, this is their worst start in the Bundesliga ever. And now, of course, another loss will not help that record. So Jesse Marsh has his work cut out for him with this team. The starting lineup today for Bayern Munich was obviously a goalkeeper, Manuel Neuer. At the back, we had Alfonso Davies, Luca Hernandez, Dayat Apamecano, Benjamin Pavard. Great to see, you know, Hernandez and Pavard back in the squad this season. Uh, we have Kimmich and Gretzka in the midfield. Great combination. Of course, we have Muller at the cam. On the wings, we had Leroy Son in the left flank and Serge Gnabry on the right. Of course, up top, we have Robert Lewandowski. So the goal scorers today for Bayern Munich were Lewandowski with a pen, uh, Jamal Musiala, Leroy Sané, great to see him back on the score sheet, and Eric Maxim Chupo Motang with the late one to put the game away. But all credit to Leipzig, Conrad Leimer, an absolute screamer from outside the top of the box. If you didn't see the game, highly recommend watching the highlights. It was a beautiful goal in the top right. Just beat Neuer with a nice little curve to the right. But as I said, it was a dominant performance for Bayern Munich. We felt in control after the first goal. I mean, that handball that led to that goal, um, I believe was the right decision, but I really do think it impacted the, the kind of atmosphere and the, the mood of the game. I really do think that, you know, with this momentum that Bayern took after that first goal, we started to really run away with it. And as I said, we dominated them. Um, they just didn't look like the team they were looking like the past two years and even more um, today. It's important to note that Serge Gnabry did start the game but was taken off just before half as a precautionary injury removal. The substitutes for this game were Nicholas Schul, Chupo Monteng, Marcel Sabitzer, Jamal Musiala, and Josip Stanisic. So my player of the game today was Jamal Musiala, once again impressing, and you know there's not much I can take away from his performance. He had a nice goal and a beautiful assist, perfectly crossed, under pressure to Leroy Sané inside the box. All Sané had to do was you know, tap it in. I know it was a volley, um, but it was a great goal and amazing setup by Jamal Musiala there. We really do have something special in Moose. I also thought Davies and Kimmich also played particularly well. I thought Davies was great making runs at the left and, you know, providing Musiala with those assists. I do think Davies and Musiala are building up a pretty strong connection on the left side of the pitch. Excited to see that partnership in years to come, hopefully. I was a bit disappointed in Lewandowski today. His shooting was off. Um, he skied a couple balls. He wasn't always given amazing opportunities, but uh, you know, just for Lewandowski, not to nitpick, but I know he did score, but it wasn't his best performance. But I am really excited how the team played today. You know, I did an excellent job of handling one of the best teams in the Bundesliga. So I think this is a great performance, especially on the road at the Red Bull Arena. And you know, I have very, very high optimism heading into the Champions League. Our first game is on Tuesday, and you know, we're just starting to really get into our groove and find our form. So I cannot wait to see some Champions League action. I can't wait for Tuesday when we take on Barca. So make sure to chime in on Monday. I will be doing my match preview for the Barcelona Clash. So make sure to come to this channel and you can watch that video there on Monday. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. If you want to see more content like this in the future, make sure to leave a subscribe. I really appreciate all the support you guys have been showing. So thank you for that.